I will guide you along the best pathway for your life. I will advise you and watch over you. Growing up, many of us never figure out what that best pathway is. Until one day, something big happens. Deep left field, big lead, home run number one for Paul Goldschmidt. How about this kid? What a big moment. Goldschmidt, a fly ball, deep center field, grand slam, Goldie. RBI single for Paul Goldschmidt. That's RBI number 49 to lead the National. High in the air, the left-hand side. It's off the ball and a home run. 26-year-old Paul Goldschmidt is the face of the Arizona Diamondbacks. He's currently on track to supplant Red Sox Earl Webb for most doubles in a season, one of the longest reigning records in the MLB. And he was chosen as the fan favorite to play on the 2014 National League All-Star team. But when asked if this was always a dream of his, his answer was a little less sensational. I started playing t-ball. My parents encouraged me to play. Or, um, I went there and just loved baseball from, from that moment forward. And um, I never knew that I was going to be fortunate enough to be able to make a career out of it so far, but I just enjoyed playing it and just, you know, made the high school team. But I knew if I continued to work hard, I at least had an opportunity to, um, you know, be good enough to, to go play in college. Paul was right. His hard work earned him a scholarship to play for Texas State University, where he set two school records for career home runs and runs batted in, along with earning several conference awards. During his collegiate career, he caught the eye of many major league teams but he also caught the eye of a member of the Bobcats golf team. We ended up meeting in study hall there. Um, freshman year, you're required to go and, and study so many hours a week to make sure you keep your grades up. They asked you to meet the person next to you and whatever, so I ended up meeting him and then really we started dating freshman year and it's all history from there. We got married after my senior year and, um, and now we've been married for almost four years. And it's Amy who Paul says has been his rock and was by his side through his entire journey to the MLB and continued to support him as he became the face of a franchise and a household name. Paul is a superstar in the eyes of many d fans, but it's his character and the couple's actions off the field that sets him apart from so many athletes. Amy, you mentioned to me off camera that this is just more than showing up a couple times a year. Exactly what all do you do with Children's Hospital? Um, well, we try to go at least once a homestand. Um, sometimes that's just once a month, sometimes it's twice, maybe three times a month. It just depends on what the schedule allows. But uh, we go as much as we can and we just try to interact and um, donate more of our time than anything and just hang out with the kids. Part of being a professional athlete is you're given a stage and you can do with it what you want. And, um, given that opportunity to just try to take advantage and, and use that and try to help others and it's been great. I mean, whatever you do, you go out there and you volunteer your time or something, it ends up, you think you're positively impacting other people and, and they end up, you know, impacting you in such a great way and so um, it's just um, try to do whatever I can and, uh, you know, sometimes it's better than others but uh, just try to help out as much as possible. You can really make an impact on people because they do look up to you, they look up to him. Um, we love going to the Children's Hospital, it, you know, to see their smiles, it's amazing. Like, just to see him walk into a room and he can light up someone's entire day, it's, it's really unbelievable. When Paul and Amy aren't at the field or volunteering, they enjoy the little things like cooking meals together. We've got new recipes, we like to try new things. Paul's actually a really good cook, better than I am. <laughs> Walking their golden retrievers, Brinkley and Bentley. And whether at home or at a Bible study, spending time in God's Word, something Amy says has brought them closer together. When we go to the Bible studies, we're able to talk on the same level. You know, I have my Bible studies I have with the wives, and he has his with, you know, when he goes to the field, and it's really cool to be able to talk about the same things. And, I mean, we're not perfect. We're still growing and we're still learning, but um, I do think it's definitely brought us closer. For a young couple involved in the unpredictable field of Major League Baseball, that's important. And as they continue to focus on faith, family, and giving back to the community, they can trust that God will lead them exactly where they need to be.